I'm gonna be making more money than me. Uh huh. <laughs> but hey, yeah. That's so great, so huh? I, I told her, yeah, she tries to leave me. I'm asking for alimony. Okay. Seriously. <laughs> you Seriously. can't go anywhere. Sorry. <laughs> Seriously. So so you know she's a full time student. Wow. She's a full time mom. Mm -hmm. Full time uh, mm -hmm. worker. Uh, full time first lady. Full time wow. husband. And I really don't know how she gets it all done. Mm. And she gets it all done, man, with a smile on her face. And so face. what type of person could not appreciate, you know, a, a person like that, man, right. that, that's in your corner? So yes. I, really, I really love this lady and really got great admiration. Mm -hmm. Well, you know what? She is definitely a role model in this area. And, then, you know, because we see first ladies as... Uh, Hey, they just that's the pastor's wife. She always uh this is the the what the people say. Now, I'm right. not gonna say we cause I I know how it is. Right. She's you know, the first lady is always got kind of spoiled, they kinda get what they want, you know, and, and really that's because people are jealous of that when 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 it comes to their pastor. Right. Very territorial, right. but you gotta understand this is my husband. You yeah. know, that's how the people they, yeah. they don't understand that all the time. But it is such a balance. What first lady do, you know, how, I, I saw how you was packing up the packing pass up to go out of town. I was like, look yeah. at her. And then when, when you was asking for the toothbrush, yeah. well, she said, I always pack the toothbrush. She was busting up. Oh, yeah, she was, but she did it with a smile on her face. I, I know, I and loved that's what she it. does. She points her finger at me uh -huh. and, you know, fusses at me with a smile on her face. Wow. I can't even argue back. Oh, and I'm going argue. <laughs> what, well, well, tell me this. When you first met D, did you know that was just your wife? When you first laid enough eyes yeah. on her. just got a little bright. When, when, I, when I seen D, D was walking down the street right out here. No, I need you to show me. This street right down here. Highway 90. She was walking on Highway 90. What? And I saw her. I didn't see her face. I just saw her shake mm. from the back. And that was enough. That got you. That right? was it. Tell it. Tell that, the truth. That was it. And so, see? <laughs> so, it was it. That was it. Wow. That was over. And, and uh, wow. I asked her for a number. Mm -hmm. But but our story is so interesting. People don't know this. Uh -huh. But when, when I met D, mm. D was younger than I was. Uh -huh. And she already knew who I was. And actually, I had talked on the phone with her uh -huh. for a couple of months before. Yeah. And you didn't know who no. she was? No. And actually had set up a date with her and everything. And went to pick her up. And she stood, and she stood me up. <laughs> and so when I met her and we started talking, that was the girl wow. that lived in the house behind Blue Moon Grill. And man, when, when oh we found out goodness. that that we were each other, I mean, it was meant to be. Plus, our birthdays are uh, day apart. Oh God! Uh, man, yeah, you know, yeah, yeah. So it was little stuff. Awesome. It was little stuff like that. And, uh, it being a young man and knowing that she was a young woman, I knew it was time. Wow. I knew it was time to get married. Mm. And, and man, I, I made the best choice I was going to go. You did. You did. You did. Yeah. And she's always lit up. I mean, she's always bright. She's always just. Who, who and does that for you? <laughs> See? <laughs> That's awesome. Did he make you say that? Did he tell you to say that before? <laughs> But you know what? I believe it. I believe it because one thing that I know, and I've I've known y'all for years, especially you, Pastor. I mean, you would always be honest. You would always be truthful. You know, when it came down to it, I don't know what you did, whatever. You know, I'm saying, but when it came down to it, you just like, look, I'm gonna tell y'all something. You had that's the attitude that you have. You know, and I know that when something is genuine, when it's genuine, you can just people can see it. Right. If things weren't like this, right. you would be, be like, look, you know what, I'm struggling right now. Yeah. I'm, you're the, yeah. But you, when you compliment me, right. when you talk about her, yeah. I mean, there's I, you mean from the oh, bottom yeah. of your heart. I can just feel it. Most certainly. And, and me and Dee, we, we got an awesome story to tell, too. And we, we've talked about, thought about writing a, a, book, mm -hmm. a book together. Uh, and we, we got a title, too. Wow. Uh, out, of, out of a nightmare into a dream. Uh, because our marriage started out so right. Mm. And there was nothing based on anything she had done. Right. It was based on my immaturity mm -hmm. and, and mm -hmm. things I didn't know about life. Right. And so I take full blame for that. But, but what, what, what we learned from each mm -hmm. other through those circumstances that love comes on. And at the end of that, at the end of that, what I decided to do 
Listen, you got to own your own story. Ah. You got to own your story. No, I wasn't going to let nobody else good. tell my story. Uh. I was going to make sure I own my own story. Wow. So nobody in the street could tell me or anybody else what? things I had done in exactly. my past or anything like that. Listen, we own that story. Mm. And what we are, we are a true testament about the grace of God. My we are a true testament about how God can turn lives Ooh, around. God. And so I wouldn't trade anything in my mm. life, and I definitely wouldn't trade just you. My God. Know, so. And that's awesome because, you know, that's the greatest this is that makes the greatest relationships when when it was rocky when it when you didn't know what to do when right. you're still growing right. when God just gets in the middle and just oh just deal that thing yeah. it's just just awesome yeah. but you guys are truly uh, a testament of um, a good marriage a marriage that God has created and just blossomed and y'all give all of us who are single hope you know, we can't give up because we know there are good people out here in the world and I just thank God for y'all. Thank y'all for just allowing me to invade your space, your beautiful home, your yard. My, my dog so isn't peaceful. happy. He's not I know, happy. I know, we're, we're almost done, but I'll just stay right there, okay? Uh, <laughs> but we thank y'all so much. Thank I love y'all. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, yes. That was a good interview. Yes, I love it. You're watching Life in the Now TV's Pastors and Ministers' Wives series. Watch full episodes online at nowismytime.org. Yeah. Yeah. This producer's cut is brought to you by Marco's Pizza. Find a location near you at marcos.com. My life is about making calls. I am <laughs> always on the phone, and so I'm calling our stylist right now to see where we're going to be as far as uh, getting the hairstyle for the upcoming episode. Behind the scenes, everybody. Getting ready for the docu series. It takes work, but you want to put in your best so you can get the best out of it. Makeup artist and your artist, the host, Nikki Yarbrough. Why is it important to go all the way? Well, in the studio, especially, you have to be mindful of the lighting. So, a light, the lighting for studio users a lot of times can cause a lot of shadows under your eyes the oil in your skin to reflect even more, so you really want to be able to tone that down. That's the most specific reason for shooting, you know, getting your makeup professionally done for camp. Uh-huh, yeah. It's our stylist, everybody, and ho, see y'all later. Okay, you can sit down. Can you believe this? Is it an issue with that box there? No, it looks good. This is fantastic. It's fantastic. Right now, now, ministry, God, we thank you for this vision that you place on their hearts, God. Lord, we ask that you give them the resources, God. And Lord, we ask that you give them the audience, God. We ask that through this series, God, that someone be blessed. Matter of fact, God, let the world be blessed, God. We ask that you bless Now, can we just let them know the behind the scenes before we take... Y'all are classmates. Yes, we are classmates. Right, so... And here's the thing. Everyone knew... I was going to be a preacher. No one should have dared figure that out about me. All right. I mean, so y'all are high school, like the crew. Like, y'all know knew each other in high Come on, man. Yeah, I got some stories, too. Oh. <laughs> Next time we'll do behind the scenes of Nicky Y'all. <laughs> <laughs> love it. Love it. Love it. Wow. It's nice out here. It's about the house, but it's about the love. But that's another thing about her, though. You know, she put... She put her own desires aside. Mm -hmm. We got a book in it, it's thick. Mm -hmm. with, with her dream home in it that we were wow. like this close to getting done. Wow. Uh, and she put all that aside to support um, yes. support my career. Let's see your what now? I'm, 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 I'm from Gretna, <laughs> Florida. They There's they another city that. about me. Uh -huh. they had that and so you keep it real when you go home. Oh, this is, 
This is it. It's beautiful. We got though. dogs. We got chickens. Um, we got the boy playing outside. I mean, switch on. Switch on. That's that life. Beat this. You are about that life. That country this life. life. All right. This is the life. Uh, here we go. One, two, three. Right, we gotta go one more. One, two, three. Got it. Man, y'all look great. Say something to the nations. It's time for this show to go. Hey, it's time to go. Pick it up. <laughs> we gotta go. Pull it. Do something. <laughs> Listen, BET, MTV. I'm from the country. I'm gonna say it like I feel. Ain't got nothing on life tonight. That's it. That's it. Yeah. We got to go. We got to go. What is going on? I thought we were welcome here. What? What's going on? Hallelujah. Good time. The bedroom. Oh. oh my God. Well, we better go. That's his wife. Okay. Excuse me. Go. Excuse me. I'm sorry. Listen, she done dressed up. She done dressed up. She done dressed up. I'll see you later. started skating with my friend. He had an extra board and then he just gave it to me and I've been skating ever since. Well, when I don't learn a trick and I have my mind set on something and I'm not getting what I want, I just keep going for it until I get it right. She didn't go to college, so she wants me to experience that whole thing. And so I could end up getting, like, a good job. I think to get into college, I'll have to be determined. Just like when I want to get a new trick. And skating's helped me realize I've got what it takes. Read to a child today and spark a lifetime of ambition. Okay, so we're on, right? Mm -hmm. Okay, hey everybody. Hey, this is El Michelle Media. El Michelle Media is a media boutique. Global storytelling is what we're all about. Seriously, man. Think about it. Your message, right? is an original, it's unique, it's authentic. So you need an original way to package your content for your social media website, your regular website. You know you have an audience. There are people who are waiting to hear your message. They're waiting to hear from you. But you gotta put it in a story form. I think that's what you need. You need a good story. We can help you get it done. We develop your content, we package it, distribute it, and repeat it. So all you gotta do is set up your first story session and we'll be good to go. Let's get your story started. Just make sure it's life inspiring. That's where we do our best work. What you say you are and have no The founders of America's three biggest pizza companies are named Tom, Frank, and John. But Marco's Pizza has a founder named Pasquale, who was actually born in Italy.
Marcos, authentic Italian pizza.